Edmund to serve as she goes to the back row, but she will be a threat from there. Benson with the dig, shot outside. That's going to be too tight. Good reset from Presley. Saucy down the line, more defense from Hens. Left side, Linehan, roll shot, and yes, for all the heat, it is a roll shot to finish. With Team Edmund, they rallied after losing the first set to win again and run to 2-0 last evening. Nutsara Tomcom fastball to Ali Linehan, 37 in orange on the pin. I love the feed. Nutsara Tomcom stays on the ground, doesn't jump, and just feeds her quickly in the middle blocker. Saskia Hippo, one of those players known by her single moniker, Sassi, like a Sasa. We do have one of those. Backslide, McCage. Now, Molly McCage has been the number one middle off the board each weekend. Molly McCage, I had to look this up twice. Nine kills, hit 471 both of the nights this weekend. The game of Team Edmund is going to go through that left side with number 22 and the captain, Leah Edmund. Vanderwide, another good pass. And she'll swing. I wondered if she might be the key here for Hens, Holly McPeak. 700 committed coming into the weekend. We have only added gratuitously to that total. That one looked like a big touch to me in live action. I really enjoy listening to her lead the team. We've seen them lose a set and come back. So let's see how they respond. And Sarah, beautiful set from her. Dominated by Team Hens defense. Yeah, six blocks, one ace, and hit 320 as a team. Yeah, 320 as a team, along with those other stats, it works every time, basically the entire match. Vandewey, another good pass, doing her job. And a hand. Woo! Beautiful rhythm and timing to that set from Nutsara Tomcom to Ali Linehan on the left pin. These two pins have benefited from the exceptional play in the middle, for sure. Volleyball being a team game, all the synergy has been there. Nutsara turns and plays it. Hence, outside, Linehan, another big cut and a winner for a second time. 8-3. The Unlimited Club, you can be a U Unlimited Club UC Gold member and you'll receive a volleyball gold box that includes an exclusive jersey, a Morgan Hens bobblehead, and more. Listen, limited quantities are available. I know there's two less because I have a bobblehead of Morgan Hens. Go on over to auprosports.com slash membership. Filled in that opposite spot perfectly to complement all the other weapons. There's another short serve, and Edmund is out. So Holly McPeak, you again appear to have a line directly into the teams to talk strategy. Vanduat, a good read. McCage puts it away in front of the center, a gap the other direction. Not only is Team Hens dominating defensively, watch them run this middle ball in transition. This is just a free ball. So advantage to the offensive side, but Nutsara Tomko. Most dominant performance I've seen by a team in Athletes Unlimited Volleyball this season. Vanda White, a good spot, platform out. Hens calls it. McCage, Linehan, another combination. This time it's McCage for another kill. Yeah, I know who the first middle drafted is. Molly McCage. Yeah, she's off the board tomorrow. You don't pick her first, you're not getting number five. Fantastic hitter coverage by Morgan Hens, the Libero and captain of this team, took middle. McCage, five of six. I'm, I'm glad to see her finally upping her numbers. I mean, 471, whatever. All right, how about six of seven? <laughs> she established herself as a threat in front and then drives behind, quick arm through the seam of the Edmund block. Look at how, those big, powerful steps. Yeah, she stayed in front for <laughs> Linehan is confident. Create some fire and energy on your side of the net. Whoever it is, let's get it going our direction. Uh, you can't take it from Molly McCage. And yeah. it seems almost every time Tori Dixon is a fantastic blocker, but Molly McCage has a quick arm and gets through that seam so quick. Look at that. Hence, good call. Perfect pass. What a hand. Wow. Didn't quite get all of it, but that was enough for a kill. McClendon. Going down the line to Linehan. 
She'll get it right back and tip it with nobody home. That was well executed. And they are to a set point for Hens. If you're with us for our first match, Team Hilly picked up their first victory of the weekend, 72-59 over Team Rosenthal, who went 0-3. Taz Brown, Molly McCage, touch, turn, deliver. Let's check in with Key Michael. I mean, she's loving this middle play, I know that. But whatever <laughs> else it is you have, Key. Is this the start of the orange onslaught once again? Utsara delivers to Vanderweide, and someone in the crowd goes home with a volleyball. Just take it, it's yours. Also out of the back row. I mean, she's the one hitter who hasn't been positively going off and playing a support role. And that's her second kill. I can't think of any reason why you would serve Morgan Hunt. Another dime pass and then a back row attack by Hennessy. And what a fights off that tough serve. And that ball can't be played. Hey, we talked about that on another night. Use of the right or left hand with a ball. Yeah, I think the left ball, the left hand of Yosiana Presley should have been the one. On back, but also to the front row. Full strength front row for Team Hens. Good touch, Hens perfect dig. Tori Dixon's had a couple of really close plays. And there's a heater from Vanderweide. Lindsay Vanderweide now 13 kills of 17, because she's at 13 of 16 right now. Instead, it's outside Vanderweide. Linehan with the dig. That ball was out, played anyway. McCage, right side. Yes, winner! Molly McCage. It's her world, you're just living in it. 14 of 17. Wow. We are living in it. What a fun performance by Molly McKay.